Today we're going to look at how to find out how much content you have to write to rank for a given keyword phrase. Yes, there is a tool that will tell us exactly the amount you need to write to rank top 10. So if I've heard it once, I've heard it a thousand times, how much do I have to write to rank for that keyword? I hear it all the time. And historically, you would have to guess. Well, I'll do 300 minimum is what we used to tell clients. But what if the top 10 all are at 10,000? You gave it a good step, but you're way, way out of your league in regard to how much content you created. There is a fantastic tool that I'm so geeking out over right now that's in semrush.com. Now I have an account, I have their Guru account. It's $99 a month. You can sign up for a seven day full trial. You just have to give them their credit card and they won't charge you for seven days and you can use the, you can use the tool all you like. But I'm gonna go ahead and log into my account and I think you'll see why I pay for this tool is really, this one tool is, is compelling enough to pay $99 a month, depending upon how much content you're creating. Okay, so when you come into SEM Rush, you'll see my dashboard right here. You're gonna scroll down to SEO content template. So what we're going to do is now I'm going to, whatever keyword that I want to rank for, I'm going to put um, SEO coaching. Now I'm like, how much do I have to write for that? Is it 10,000? Is it 20? I don't exactly know. We go in here. What this tool does is it goes to the top 10 sites that currently rank for SEO training or SEO coaching, I should say, and calculates a formula by which I'm going to write my page to. I just need to know why those top 10 are the top 10. What are they doing and what can I do to make myself look just like those top 10? I don't want to study the Google algorithm. I don't have time for that. I just want to look like the cool kids. I know what sandwich to eat. I know where to sit in the lunchroom. I know how to wear my hair. I have a gorgeous glamour shot. I should probably pop in here now. That shows my 80s hairdo. It's really nice. Anyway, I was not a cool kid. I was a choir geek, so never knew what that was. However, when you're going after ranking for a keyword, you gotta look like a cool kid. You gotta look like the top 10. So check this out. So here's the report. Here's the top 10 sites that currently rank for that phrase. Here are all the keywords that currently are in play amongst those top 10. What are they all have in common? What are they talking about that's the same across those top 10? I'm gonna talk about those things. Then you come down here and I have to write 624 words exactly. So 624 is the magic number because that's the average across the top 10 right now. So if I wrote less than that, uh-uh. If I wrote more than that, uh-uh. I have to hit it right at 624 and I have to reference SEO training, digital marketing, SEO campaigns. You'll see I have a whole list. I just have to tick each one of those off as I'm writing. So what happens is, as you launch this page, you've instantly look like a cool kid because you knew how to optimize that page, you knew what to talk about on that page, and you knew exactly how much content to write for it. And this has been a, is, is a massive game changer. When you are thinking about how much time do I have to put into writing a piece of copy, is it 10,000, is it 100,000? You just don't know. This stops the guesswork and you're able to actually go in and know the exact amount of copy that you need to write to rank for that phrase. Now, I've got a bonus tip. SEMrush has a tool that works with Google Docs. Now, I know a lot of people aren't crazy about Google Docs, but this might be a reason to get crazy for it. So you go to google.com slash docs. Okay, when you come in here, make sure you're logged into your SEMrush account. And we're gonna go in here and we're gonna create a new, I'm gonna start writing this amazing piece of copy based on these rules that have now been given to me. Now, inside of uh, Google Docs, there's something called add-ons right here. And SEM Rush has a custom add-on called the SEM Rush SEO Writing Assistant. So we're gonna turn that on. Now here's the cool thing. It takes that template I just generated and it's gonna grab it. And so as I'm writing my content, it's grading me on the side. It's grading me to make sure I hit all those topics. So you'll see right here, SEO coaching is right there. I need to be able to write 818 words and it's also giving me all the recommendations for what I have to write about, all those little nuances. And so as I write, it's gonna start grading my work. 
And as I use those keywords, those keywords are going to turn green. So there is no reason for you not to be able to hit that mark when you use the SEO Writing Assistant for Google Docs. It's an add-on. You don't have to do that. Or you can just write it and then just pop it in here and see how it measures up. But if we get the cheat sheet on how to rank, we're going to use it. And that's the SEO Content Template in SEMrush.com. Live it, learn it, love it. Because it is a game changer for how to actually rank for one piece of content. Is your mind blown now? Did you think there was actually a tool that will tell you exactly how many words to write to rank? It is amazing. And SEM Rush is one of my favorite tools. And I'm going to continue to create individualized content for all the different nuances and secrets that live inside of SEM Rush. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel or visit us on our website at findability.com.